Welcome to this bonus video about graphs or plotting or both. Pause the video, have a go at this one in your own time. See you back here. Okay, let's plot the green point first, two and two. And then we can do this one in red. Let's do the rest in black. Zero, or purple in fact. Zero, zero goes there. Minus three, minus three goes there. So we can now go, oh, oh look, I can see a line. I mean, my graph's a little bit messy, but it should have been a straight line. What's the rule? What is true all the way along that line? Hmm. Ah, oh, well, the number on the left is the same as the number on the right. And remember that the number on the left is x, the number on the right is y, which means that x is the same as y. How do we write x is the same as y in maths language? We write x equals y. There we go. have a go at the next one. Welcome back. Plot the first one in red. x is minus 3. y is 0. I'm going to do the next one in green. x is minus 3. y is 5. Let's do the next one in purple. x is minus 3, y is minus 2. Okay, so what's, uh, well there's the pattern. What's the rule? Mm, the number on the left is always the same, which is x. x is always equal to minus, how do we write x is equal, always equal to minus 3 in maths language? We write x equals minus 3. That's the rule for that line. Have a go at the last one. Obviously pausing the video to give yourself time. Let's plot this first. X is 3, Y is 1. X is minus 4, Y is 1. We see in a pattern here, I think we are. X is minus 1, Y is 1. Let's draw a line. Oh, look, that looks like the line. How do we describe this rule? <clears throat> well, the number on the right is always 1. Or we could say, just looking at the line on the graph, all the way along here, y is always equal to 1, but x is always changing. So the rule obviously involves y, and the rule is that y equals 1. Thanks for watching.